The most common question I'm asked is about in-camera seamless transition sound effects, not whoosh sound effects. So in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you three easy ways to get seamless transition sound effects. The first one is using free sound effects pack. The second one is from cloth sound effects. And the last one is utilizing the sound of birds flapping their wings. Inside Premiere Pro, we have already a clip of a seamless transition on the timeline. Are you interested in learning how I created this transition? If so, you can watch the tutorial, link in the description. Let's begin with the first method which is using a free plugin from AE Juice. As you can notice 4 free packs here and you find the download link of these plugins in the description below. We will be using the sound effects pack so simply click on it to open the pack. By the way, if you are looking for more details about AJU's plugins such as the installation process and how to use it, you can definitely find the link of the tutorial in the description of this video. Now you can see various sound effect categories on the left side of this pack. At the bottom of this list, you will find the hoot sound effects. Let's explore a few of them. Now let's dive into the specific of in-camera seamless transitions where we will apply paper sound effects. Click on the paper sound effects category to explore it. Now we can preview some of the sounds from the top of the list. Let's choose the first one and simply double click on it to input it onto the timeline. Next we need to drag the sound to the right where the transition is actually taking place. Let's see how it sounds. It sounds good but there are some options to improve it. Double click here to expand the audio layer then use the rate stretch tool which you can also access with the shortcut R key on the keyboard. Now click on the edge of the audio and drag it slightly to the left or right to adjust its speed. Here it's make some changes let's switch to the selection tool and reduce the audio level. Additionally, you can apply the default transition for audio which is the constant power by right clicking on the edge of the audio. This way you can make some adjustments to get the best result from the audio effect. Let's progress to the next step of using cloth sounds as in-camera seamless transition sound effects. I have already placed a cloth sound on the timeline. Now you can simply drag it to the left beneath the transition area. By the way, you can record this sound yourself or source it from the internet. Now let's play the transition, you can also replace it. If you want you can fine tune its audio volume. At this moment we are at the final step of this tutorial. Now I am gonna double click on the audio of the bars flapping wings to open it in the source monitor. If I play the audio, it sounds like this. Perfect for seamless sound effects. Let's select the best part of the audio by setting an in point and an out point. Next drag the selected audio onto the timeline and place it underneath the transition. It appears that the duration of this sound is a bit short so we need to extend its length. Let's right click on the audio edges to use the constant power transition. If desired you can use the rate stretch tool to adjust its speed. Simply click on the audio edges and drag them left or right to change the speed. This is a great way to enhance audio effects. Now switch back to the selection tool and play the transition. If necessary you can modify the duration of the audio transition. You might not be hearing the actual sound because of the screen recording. That's all for creating in-camera seamless transition sound effects. I have shared some ideas on using various sounds for this purpose. I hope you find it helpful. Stay tuned for the upcoming tutorial. See you then.